alludes to that too, the Godfather of the Table, uh, from which we delved into this Indian raga called Charikesh. Now, is there anything in common in terms of raga? Right? Uh, I believe so. Uh, if you take the, the gypsy mode, right, one of the most popular gypsy modes uh, mode is the minor major. So, for an Indian musician, that is. Uh, too much. 
what we want to do next? Uh, do you want to add something to do? The challenge? Yeah. Um, not really. I think you've pretty much covered it. I mean, this time it's a really soulful album and it's, it's got a uh, very beautiful mood. It can actually convey both happiness and sadness because of the mind and mind scale. So, which I think is conveyed in that song as well. That's pretty much it. Yeah, yeah. Um, of course, there's a whole, the understanding of emotion, happiness, and sadness, I think there is something in common. I mean, we have an Indo American crowd here, so we can relate to both. Uh, I don't know if, uh, you know, two centuries ago, Indians understood minor as sad and major as sad. I don't think so. I, I, because if you look at some of the older uh, musical descriptions, and even under the Britney and so on, there isn't that sort of uh, clear black and white that one signifies a mood. The entire raga had a personality. Something that seems depressing could actually be elevating. So it's very, uh, it's not an exact science. Uh, yeah, so uh, the next thing we wanted to explore musically, and before we do that, do you have any questions? Uh, do you feel like you have to throw your hand to this discussion? Is there a why have you not taken the common ragas like Kalyani? Why not Kalyani? Because that all of us understand. Is Charu not common? Charu okay. It's a little higher level. I see. I started with Kalyani, but then it was a pure Indian, pure raga. Uh, Indian uh, presentation. I, we can definitely explore uh, maybe later, you know, towards the end of the program, maybe Shankara or something like that. that that might be interesting. Of course, there is Mohana, that entire family of pentatonics, which is at the heart of uh, blues and jazz. Pentatonic and the, and the blue scale uh, is really uh, variants of Sudha Danyaji. The other question are. is, to combine Shubha Pantuvarari right. like that, I'm sure your music will really be very soft. I think we wanted to take a rock on that lent itself to jazz. So, which is I don't understand. Yeah. I'm asking. Combining that. It is a great idea. In fact, the next raga we, we have chosen is not uh, is not at all found in jazz music. So we are going to bring in ideas from the jazz world and uh, present it more like a Carnatic fusion exploration. Uh, let's see how that goes. Uh, 